All right. So to talk about the traces improvement, uh, let me go over here on the collaborative tab and you will see the traces. Again, this is not a brand new feature because we already had this, but let me show you the improvements. So if we open the traces palette by clicking on it, you have this um, trace palette, of course, but the improvement was that before in AutoCAD 2022 and older versions, you could only add these um, markups or traces um, on the online and the application for mobile AutoCAD. You couldn't add it on the desktop version of AutoCAD, but AutoCAD changed that and improved it. So you could only, you could also use uh, this feature on the desktop version. And let me show you how. So if we go over here, we can create a new trace by clicking this icon over here. So let's do it right now, click. And basically here is a way, trace is basically a way to collaborate uh, using markups, annotations, and so on. But a collaboration between the AutoCAD desktop in your computer, the AutoCAD online with, um, you know, uh, web browser and the AutoCAD mobile, the AutoCAD in your phone or in your iPad or, you know, so on. So basically it is a way to collaborate between those three platforms, but the new, the new update now makes you also use this feature on your desktop, on your computer. So, so once you're here, um, you can simply use the regular revision cloud to, you know, add some markups over here. Um, maybe you can, for instance, um, you can say something like, um, you know, I'm gonna draw really quick a revision cloud like so, and then I can simply type something using the regular text command. I can say, um, hey, use only one door, remove one door here. Something like that, right? This is just to give you an example. So once we do that, we can accept that by clicking this close tra trace icon and you will see a new trace or markup was added over here. So basically now uh, the collaboration part comes when you will see your markups and of course apply those changes. So let's keep moving. Um, 